Come on. And they're away. Football jumped up all right. Coming to the first of the 11 flights, an Ocean Hawk going to land in the lead from uh, Bimsey and Chambrol and Pridwell. Ocean Hawk on the near side of Bimsey. Then Chabrol. Very close to group. A little pecked by Chabrol there. Gray Absalom's upsides him. Over on the far side, Pridwell. Then Moscow Express. Quite a steady pace. Two and a half miles this time. An Ocean Hawk, the leader. From Bimsey, Chabrol on the inside of Absalom's Lady. Then Pridwell and Moscow Express as they swing into the home straight on this first circuit. Face up to the flight that will be the second last next time round. An Ocean Hawk on the far side of Bimsey. Ocean Hawk being tracked in the sheepskin nose band by Chabrol towards the stand side Pridwell with Moscow Express as they jump the third. Ocean Hawk and Bimsey. Taking a good strong hold is the old grey mare, Absalom's lady, Chabrol on her far side, and Moscow Express and Pridwell as they race up towards the winning post on this first circuit. Ocean Hawk over on the far side, Bimsy on the near side, just getting into the picture, Chabrol, then Absalom's lady, Moscow Express and Pridwell not more than uh, three lengths between first and last and all going very easily within themselves as they go out towards the far side they'll be beginning their run down towards Swinley Bottom with Ocean Hawk the leader from Bimsey and just a mile and a half to run now in this Coopers and Lye brand Ascot Hurdle Ocean Hawk from Bimsey, Absalom's Lady, and then all in line, Chabrol, Pridwell, Moscow Express, as they come to the fifth. Ocean Hawk and Bimsey from Absalom's Lady, Moscow Express on the far side with Pridwell. Number six comes up very quickly, this one. Ocean Hawk, Bimsey and Admiral's Lady between Absalom's Lady between those two. Then Pridwell, Moscow Express and Chabrol. Running down to number seven of the 11 flights in all. Ocean Hawk on the inside, Bimsey on the far side, Absalom's Lady, then Moscow Express, Chabrol, and Pridwell right up with them. As they begin the right hand swing, They've got four flights left to jump in this Coopers and Lybrand Ascot hurdle. And Ocean Hawk is the leader from Bimsey. Moscow Express goes third, but Pridwell traveling very cosily on his outside. Then Absalom's Lady and Chabrol. Ocean Hawk on the inside as they come up to this one. Bimsey, Moscow Express and Pridwell. This is four out now. They're just going to jump. And Bimsey and Moscow Express just disputing ahead of Pridwell, traveling very easily. Ocean Hawk has dropped back to fourth, but is getting back into it. Three from home. Moscow Express on the inside of Pridwell, absolutely cantering Pridwell at the moment. Moscow Express on the inside of Pridwell on the near side. Ocean Hawk getting back in. Bimsy's far from done with yet. Racing now towards the next flight, and as they do so, two to jump. It's Ocean Hawk back in the lead, but Pridwell still cantering just on his outside. And then comes Moscow Express and Bimsy. Turning for home now, and Ocean Hawk, the leader from Pridwell, and Tony McCoy. Ocean Hawk and Carl Llewellyn from Tony McCoy on Pridwell as they level up for the second last flight now, and Pridwell still cantering the sheepskin nose band towards the right of the picture as we see them. Ocean Hawk, Bimsy trying to get back in it over on the far side, then Moscow Express at the second last. Pridwell lands in the lead from Ocean Hawk in second. 
Vimsy next, and then Moscow Express racing down towards the last, and he hasn't even blinked yet, Tony McCoy, and he's jumped it impeccably that last flight, and he's just looking over his right shoulder. He sees no danger whatsoever as Pridwell strides up towards the line, a really sensationally impressive winner of this Coopers and Lybrand Ascot hurdle. Pridwell being eased down as they come to the line, the comfortable winner from Ocean Hawk, Moscow Express third and Bimsey four and five was Chabrol. And so the official result, first, number three, Pridwell, owned by the Jones, Burstock and Fleet Partnership, trained by Martin Pipe and written by Tony McCoy. Second was number two, Ocean Hawk, owned by Mr. Matt Archer and Miss Jean Broadhurst, trained by Nigel Twiston Davis and written by Carl Llewellyn. And third was number five,